activist Faith. And he has searched the state for years, trying to find a couple that he's never met. Our tenders reporter Bree Steffen and our photojournalist Zach Wonderly traveled to Santa Barbara to meet a man whose focus is on San Diego. One man's mission to track down two young people in love started here in Santa Barbara, but he thinks the key to finding them is more than 200 miles away in San Diego. I just believe in love. Talk to Leon Lewandowski for five minutes. So, um, so I'm, a, I'm a, a romantic guy. It'll take you about half that time. It's really about love. To figure out he was the perfect person. They're looking deep into each other's eyes. And to find this book. One. A journal of two lovers. Story of us. For Leon, this part in this story started at La Cumbre Junior High School in Santa Barbara in 2011. I came across this leather journal. It's really, it was, wasn't dug out of the trash, it was set aside on something. So I don't know their story. I don't know the reason why, I don't know the, what, what came, became of them. The journal starts at 2006 and ends in 2007, so it's about. 18 months of, um, of love letters between Brent and Laura. Brent and Laura, two people. In Colorado, there's snow in the background. They're wearing Viking hats, and they look like they're very happy there. For the past six years. Six years, I feel like a, a detective. He's been trying to find. I just hit dead end after dead end after dead end. Until now, a new clue he's never noticed. It says up top here, Megan, uh, Winston and Megan's wedding. The entry was 2007, so I typed, I googled uh, Winston and Megan's wedding 2007, and I got a hit, I got a lead. And it points to a wedding at the Dana here in San Diego. Sunday, March 31st, 2007. This one says, uh, more San Diego pictures. This is the San Diego uh, Catamaran Resort Hotel Spa. If we could go on air somehow in San Diego, someone knows Winston and Megan, who got married a decade ago. And if we can find them, they can get this back to Brent and Laura. He knows it might not be a happy reunion. If they're still together, what a wonderful gift. If they're not together, it's really not my place to just make it that decision what happens to this. But he believes whatever happens, love lost or love found, is meant to be. I am a romantic. Because he believes in love. This could be about Laura and Brent, and this could be about kindness, but I really think it's just about love. In Santa Barbara, Bree Steffen, 10 News. Love and dedication on his part. What a thoughtful guy. Now I want Brent and Laura to be together. Yeah, I think that's the next story yeah. when we find him, so stay tuned. So Leon, you saw he was skimming through the book. He's never actually read the whole journal. He's just skimmed through it briefly looking for cues. He says he didn't want to violate their privacy. In fact, he just recently found their names. That's mm -hmm. how little he had actually looked. Bree has several calls into venues here in San Diego to try to track down the couple. And we've got more in-depth details about this story on our website, 10news.com.